All right, it's raining like a bop, um, and that might affect the audio a little bit, but we're going to go ahead and get this video done. Jojolian, chapter 100. Chapter 100 of possibly the last JoJo part of all time. Uh, very bubbly cover here. Uh, September 9th. September 9th. Uh, we got Jojo. Jo, 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 jo. I've never said it in my life. We got Josuke uh, with... Anyway, you see the cover. Let's go on. Toru, obviously the main villain at this point. Again, I still think a rocket could do a uh, woody woo and like still make Jobin the last villain. But as of right now, it appears our head doctor is the successor to Funny. Valentine. Uh, yo, I'm a bazooka. And then cake it out of here. Uh, Calamity's approach. <laughs> yo, stop. Calamity's approach from all over the world. Um, this is the world. This is hope. This is not the world, but it is the world. Uh, hopefully this, and they, they do like a rock test, like, like his face. They do like a rock texture with the kanji. That's pretty cool. Uh, Jojolian, hopefully the last part of part six. Uh, it appears that the the part I don't know. Let's, let's keep moving. Uh, first impressions. I'm I'm reading this for the first time. Uh, spurting out and the threat of da of of da da da. They didn't do the whole deed to da deed to do to do. Did it say abortion? What the fuck does that say? Uh, was clutching his heart there for a second. You got multiple bubbles. Uh, your highest of Arnie Gosh Kata Josuke. Why is like Tet so fucking off? Um, more bubbles. I forgot, like, this blinded him, right, in the last one, right? Like, it blinded him. I forgot that the effect of dot, dude, dude, dot, teeth. <laughs> that would be the worst name of anything ever in, jo in JoJo. If you extend those arms and legs, something may just show itself. It's there, climbed up onto the desk. Uh, why don't you just call it da 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 or d do da? I don't know. But yeah, it's like in his, it's in his grill. I think he has to kill it to make it stop. Uh, it's very fast. Do da da d do do do. Imagine showing somebody like from like that. I stopped watching the part two. Some of this, shit. I got a homie that hasn't watched JoJo content since part two, and I'm in part three. Imagine if I showed him do da da dee do do <laughs> against against Josuke, it's the sequel, Josuke part two, and an uh, old head doctor that is part stand part. Stand, but human looking, and he's trying to grab the, the the the, the riatsu, <laughs> the soul pressure, uh, blinding his face. This 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 is what I like. This is what I don't like about non-colored um manga, is that it's very difficult to follow this shit. Like it's damn near impossible to really understand what the fuck is happening in these fight scenes, uh, in in certain JoJo aspects. Like he just got his finger cut off. It appears. Uh, I imagine it was the finger hanging off. What's the other finger? Oh, Mamazuku used his. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah. Mamazuku used extended his shit and got his shit cut off. Even before the head doctor came to this room. Do 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 da 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 do do do. It's fucking beating her ass. Is his leg about to snap or some shit? What's about to happen? <laughs> it was a Joseph Joe star. What did that do? Did it kill it? The bug just moved from the desk to the wall. 
So he hit it through the desk with the bubbles. Josuke, you do realize you stood up. Yes, you just did out your arm and leg joints. Oh, yeah, because the stretching thing, like, if you move, it's going, it like, it like, it's, 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 um, it's green day, but instead of, like, climbing up, it hyphens, or it heightens when you move, when you stand. Do, 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 d da, da, which only target the throat. It will clog your arteries with asbestos, causing you to suffocate. That's what that is, okay. Uh, he's been hit four times now, so it's obviously accelerated. So now I moved up from the walls to the ceiling. When did Mama Zuka get up here? Is it fucking got him hanging and shit? Holy shit. Did he kill it? Did he knock the brain off of it? Is it dead? Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. I'm assuming it's not dead. That's a nice close up panel with uh, Satoru Akifu and Mama Zuko from the guy that killed his father. Is he gonna chase him? Is he gonna pursue him? It looks like he's unraveling his hand for something. I managed to get doggy style two centimeters from him. Is he referring to his stand? You think some disaster will occur to block my way, Josuke? Mama Zuka, man. Dude about to pull a gyro messing up here, man. More of a, a Caesar than a gyro, but you, you get what I mean. Clamped in. Are we sure that's not some illusion trying to fool us into believing? Yo, I, I wouldn't do it. It's just one more centimeter on that close. I thought like the second he touches him, he's going to explode. Not once has anyone gotten this close to me without a calamity befalling them. Indeed, with just one centimeter or something happened, I can't say. I know it's really no person I can cite, honestly. The Toru is such an asshole. Though I must say, I must also say that during the flow of calamity, not one person has ever managed to attack me. I can also say that as confidently really as wonder of you. <laughs> Amazuku arrived 17 years ago. Your father died in the landslide. In case you had told your father that a harmful insect had invaded your port parrot orchard, and so he went to investigate it. And long after that, your mother went underwent great mental anguish brought on by the debts because of the poor pair or you trying to bait him of before dying of illness. You're trying to hard bait him. That too was from the flow. Tor was an asshole, man. Back then as well, you're fully immersed in that flow. It's only by chance you live long enough to be here. He got him. <laughs> he baited him. Yeah, I think that's it for Mama Zuku. Is that the, what is that, a handkerchief? Did he knock his cap off? He missed? Or did he just not go for it? I don't understand what happened. I guess he just didn't go for the kill. What the fuck happened to his arm? Soap bubbles. They missed his shot if he couldn't kill him because of the soap bubbles. What the hell? The things Josuke had hidden, the things that the Calamity brought out, were these. The soap bubbles are where I showed themselves. They appear to be really floating, but among them. There are a few objects, there are a few contained objects you are making spin at high speed. So your intention was to make me approach these soap bubbles and scrape, scrape me away with them. Oh no!
But the soap bubbles hit Mama Zuku instead. He didn't even know the power of the spin. He wasn't aware that he's a Joe Star. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the spin is back. The infinite fucking spin energy. <laughs> so I had a number of your bubbles were right in front of him, but I still had to say, Joe Scar, you listen, I can only say this once. No one has realized that not even a stand has perceived it. Is this an infinite spin? I don't get it. They're lines, spinning lines. Your soap bubbles are made of soft lines that spin. The spin, that, that spin, that's all that's there. And within there are things that you cannot see. What? <laughs> okay. Um, I'm. I'm. A, I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna be. Let me make sure it's recording. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know what the fuck. I, I understand that the soap bubbles like accidentally touched uh, Mama Zuku because of the the calamity. I get that part. They hit his shoulder and they like spun his. They spun his arm off, like, off course. I think I get that part. I don't get anything else there. I don't even understand the, the spin part. I mean, I think it's a reference to part seven in, in, in part. Uh, and I also think, like, the spinning is supposed to maybe reverse the flow of, of, of what's happening or what's been happening. Ah, uh, okay. Certainly one of Mama Zuku's braids fall off. Joske had laid several bubbles in the room, but some of them were hidden and spinning at high speed. By the way, one of you come up to him, Joske hoped to let these try bubbles kill him. He snatched and collected these bubbles on the worst ones. The worst one was bubbles just pierced through my Zuko's head. Ghost explains, good fortune is a phenomenon separate from a calamity hidden in stands, but no one is aware of it. Mom Zuka bears a twirl of rope around explains to the Josuke that the soap bubbles are not what he thinks. They're soft spinning lines. Opening his chest for a large hole, Mama Zuka restates that all there is to the bubbles is their rotation. And when then them lost the unseen. Is he gonna fucking turn into Tusk Act Four? I don't get what's happening here. I, I, I I'm honestly befuddled. Is he gonna be like, <laughs> what's what's his stand's name? Uh, soft and wet, soft and wet Act Four. I don't get yo. I mean, spin energy was like a Hamon reference, right? In itself, it was basically a modern Hamon. So I don't know if like. So they confirm that that is dead. Him like knocking a thing off killed it. He brought, yeah, he brought spin back. The bubbles have spin energy, so they're not just bubbles. Like the original, I don't know where he came from. I forgot. Uh, Killer Queen, yeah, Killer Queen's, yeah, okay, yeah. The Killer Queen bubbles produced with him. All right, um. He brought spin back for a reason. Now, we knew spin was fucking, um, 
It was dimensional. It was dimensional. We from from Johnny, from Joni, from Gyro Zapelli. Uh spin was broken. I don't think I've ever seen a Rocky end two parts consecutively with the same power being featured. I say it to say like we never seen uh well, I guess we did see technically time stop in both three and four's main villains. So I guess technically we did see that, huh? The last move, the last stand he used against both Dio and um, Kira was Star Platinum, the world. So I guess we did see that. Okay. So I guess he's going to use spin. Wamu! I thought the detail of the soap bubbles were actually spinning string from chapter 70 was just some useless detail Mob Mizuka was saying. I had no idea it was going to come back like this. Rocky's been doing his fucking thing with referencing things. But 30 chapters, that's... Like they said, that's almost three years. Holy shit. When it turns out Jobin is a random ass Hamon user, combines sunlight energy with Speed King to shoot. <laughs> Yo, can they just like bring Dio back? I guess they did. They referenced Dio already. We're not going to get more Dio. Josuke is the. This is, we'll end on this. Josuke is a perfect spin user. Unlike Johnny fingernails and gyro balls, he can he can create possible infinite round objects to channel the spin. The power is fully potential. We even talk Golden Requiem. This is amazing. I don't know about that. But... This definitely is gonna re rewrite flow and calamity. That is definitely what he's going for. Oh yeah, we're gonna get another Joe, uh, another Joe bro, ending his life uh, recklessly to reveal, I guess, a true, a true power of the primary Joe story. Uh, one, it happened. Two, it happened. Three, Kakyoin, that that happened. Four, uh, Shigechi died so they could. I mean, he wouldn't be the Joe bro, but he died to, I guess, kind of show you know, who Kira was in the first place. Uh, five. I mean, everybody died so they could become, you know, so they could actually stop. I, it'd be more of a technicality, but Bruno did die initially, and that helped. That scene was the first one Jorma came into contact with, uh, with his Diavolo and allowed him to, I guess, kind of experience the R of, of how King Crimson worked. Um, Sits, it actually be reversed. Well, I, I don't know. I mean, Emporio isn't a Joe bro necessarily, but a Joe star did die to give one of the rest of the gang the chance to get the kill. And Jotaro died. Jotaro was a Joe bro, kind of, in that, in a, in a sense. He died to give Jolene a chance to, to live. Um, so, I mean, 
Part seven, I mean, obviously Gyro dies so the infinite spin could happen. Uh, hey. Keeps it going. All right, so hope y'all enjoyed this chapter especially because I don't know what the fuck happened. I believe this, we're taking a month month's break off of this. So I don't think we're getting a next one until October, I believe. I'm not sure, but I believe that's what's happening. Um, I thought it was a good chapter. I mean, it's set up. The ultimate power that we'll probably see Josuke have, which is learning spin energy. Um, we're going to get more Part 7 references, so that's always cool. Maybe we'll get to see the Part 9 very quickly. Uh, very soon. Maybe. Maybe we'll get to see it. Um, but, yeah. Uh, great chapter. Not because Part 99, but it was... <laughs> chapter 99, but it was really good. R.I.P. Mamazuki.